All right, let's cut the nonsense. This whole Jake Paul versus Mike Tyson situation is a joke. A joke. You're telling me we're going to sit here and pretend a 58-year-old Tyson stepping into the ring with a glorified YouTuber is anything more than a payday? Stop it. Prime Mike Tyson, the Iron Mike, would have ended Jake Paul in under 30 seconds. Hell, Jake wouldn't have survived the stare down, let alone the first punt. Let me paint you a picture. Mike Tyson in his prime was a force of nature. Black trunks, no socks, just business. He wasn't a boxer, he was a damn executioner. Guys were terrified before they even touched gloves. You had professional fighters praying to God in their corners and then bam, lights out in under a minute. You remember Michael Spinks? Undefeated, undisputed cruiserweight champ. Tyson erased him in 91 seconds. Jake Paul wouldn't last half of that. And let's not forget Tyson wasn't just about brute force. He had technique, speed, defense. The man was dodging punches like Neo in The Matrix. Watch the tape. He'd eat Jake alive, body shots, uppercuts, the whole thing. And let's be real, Jake doesn't have the skill, the chin, or the guts to take on a prime Tyson. Jake's game plan? Throw some flashy punches and hope nobody notices he's out of his depth. Pathetic. Now, I'm not here to hate on Mike. The man's 58, for God's sake. He's got nothing to prove. He doesn't care about legacy. He's here for the check. And you know what? Good for him. He gave us a show when we were kids, when boxing was real, when it was brutal, not this influencer garbage. But let's not kid ourselves. This wasn't about proving anything. This was a business deal. Mike got his $20 million. Jake boosted his brand. And we all got played. So... Yeah, Jake gets to say he fought Tyson. Congratulations, kid. You danced around a 58-year-old and didn't get knocked out. But don't for a second think you've earned respect, because in his prime, Tyson would have sent you out on a stretcher. No question. None. Now, send this to anyone who thinks Jake Paul has even a sliver of a chance against the real Mike Tyson. They need to wake up.